well, we weren't obviously we were 1-0 up at half time, but unfortunately it ended up in a, in a, in a 2-1 defeat. It did, and, and only ourselves to blame. And you know, we 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 get a fortuitous enough start. Andy does really well to go and press. Maybe something that players, other players, wouldn't have pressed, and we get a reward from it and get our goal. Right. And I think it sparks us, and we've other chances in the first half, um, possibly to go in in two 0 up. We I thought we started the second half quite well also, and we had four or five bites. Um, at different opportunities with different players to go and put a second on it and through maybe some OK finishing and some good goalkeeping as well it keeps it at 1-0 and then I think you always expect them to have that little spell but you just have to stand up and be kind of, it's as simple as that and, and the manner in which I think we enter into that last sort of 25-20 20 minutes of the game and then in particular how we address the ball or try to defend the ball, it, it's just it's not good enough. And that's not just defenders, it's, it's right up the park, how we give the ball away, right down to the final action before the goal is scored. Um, you know, there's a level and we've hit good levels and we've got a lot of praise out this year and and rightfully so. But we've got to chin the bar again and we've, and we've got to hit that level again. And there's so much at stake, there's so much to play for and it's not a case, you know, it's it's not acceptable. And it's not, you're not saying that people are down in tools and yes, People will say we lost a final last week, and you know there's going to be a bit of a hangover. But we don't have time for that. You know that we have to get back up and motoring. Other teams around us have dropped points today where we could have really capitalised on that, and, and and you know that's a big frustration. Yeah, I was going to going to say about that there. Obviously, the results elsewhere went in our favour, but I suppose it doesn't really matter if we, if we don't make it count ourselves. No, and and, when, and if you pick up the points, and, and we said that before the game that you just don't know you know what will happen and how teams will will fare moving into these last few games. And, and that any any three points will be a massive three points, and and you know you look, we hold on to that one nil or go and grab a second, which we should have done today, and see it out. You know those three points would move us up a, a position or two in, in the league today, and, and leave it you know really exciting moving into those last six games. So we've work to do now. You know we've we've, we've points to try and to try and grab in relation to that, and we're going to have to have hit some big performances now. Yeah, a few people look at we lost the League Cup final last year, but we were stranded in sixth. Whereas this year, it's totally different. Cause it's a totally stop. different scenario. Absolutely, a totally different scenario. And um, you can be forgiven last year in relation to that, whether you like it or not, you weren't going to make any headway from a position point of view. You know, we're six points better off than we already were last year. But we want to go and you know hit double figures, and now we want to go and make a big inroad into into last year's point total. Um, and also, just there's there's a lot at stake. You know, there's European places up for grabs. Uh, and, we, and we want to be in the mix for that and we want to be in and around that by whatever way that's possible and you know to me there's still an opportunity or there was still an opportunity and probably is still for th for that third position when you look at how you think what we're five or six points behind third so you know it's mathematically it's it's not impossible but we need to go and and number one we need to really go and get back up in our performance levels and we've got to go and pick up a lot of points now in this next our last six games. Yeah, and finally, look, you'll be wanting the the end the the, the pre-split fixtures in high when, when we welcome Lauren to the showgrounds. Yeah, and um, more than that, we just we've got to get back to doing what we've done for big parts of this season. You know that that early part was a wee bit abject and up and down. We've hit a real level of consistency in the last four or five months, and big credit to the players for that. But you know, we just can't allow it at this stage to, to drop off. And that's me, that's ev that's coaches, that's everybody. You know, we've got to make those demands and players of each other to make sure that we go um, and give this a real a real go. Cheers, Ron.